We've flown Southwest for 20 years now. It's an airline. Years and years and years. With a loyal fan base. We fly exclusively with Southwest because we like them so much. For more than 50 years, Southwest Airlines has prided themselves on an open boarding system where you choose a seat once you board. Flyers check in 24 hours beforehand and based on how quickly they do, fall into boarding group A, B or C. But that's all about to change. Southwest says they're now doing away with the boarding frenzy and giving you an assigned seat like any other airline. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, that's pretty cool. So when is that going to go into effect? They didn't say when, but airline leadership expects to have more details in September. I don't like it. I'm very picky. I like choosing my seats. Not great news for eight-year-old Vivian Doherty, her dad, and their family of six. We are usually in the first people to board because we have the priority access, and then that way we can go in and get a whole two rows. But a welcome change for someone like Monica Carr. Once I bought my ticket, I don't really want to scramble for my seat. Or Kyle Shumaleski. Yeah, I mean, I'm a big guy, uh, you know, got long legs. Who may be interested in the new seats with extra leg room Southwest will soon offer as well. But no matter what kind of flyer you are or how you feel about these changes. You know, you're on a plane, you're safe, you're comfortable. It doesn't really matter where you sit at the end of the day. Now, in addition to those seating changes, Southwest says there will be more flights now on this board, including a new red eye from Los Angeles to Nashville. That'll start in mid-February. At BNA, I'm Nikki Hauser, News Channel 5.